Check it out. This is Microsoft Encarta. It's an encyclopedia that takes off where other encyclopedias end. You'll be amazed at how Encarta brings information to life. We'll look something up so we can show you what we mean. Let's travel to Africa. Type in the first few letters. See how the list of contents scrolls as you type? Click the topic name and you're off. Here we are at the Africa topic. This is the main window. It's divided into four parts. The category frame, the article frame, the gallery frame, and the main button bar at the top. The category frame tells you that Africa is in a category called Regions of the World. By clicking these buttons, you can visit other topics in the same category, or change categories altogether. And Carta covers more than 90 different categories. But let's stick to Africa. The article frame over here has tons of good information. You can zoom in to make the text bigger, or zoom out just as easily. When you read an article, you may see small icons like these camera and map icons. They stand for gallery items. Gallery items are pictures, sounds, and things like animations and maps. We'll cover these later when we get to the gallery frame. On the right, the scroll bar helps you read through the article. The moving scroll box tells you how far through the article you've gotten. Drag it to move forward or back. Since this is a long article, it might be easier to use the outline. The outline shows all the headings and gallery items in the topic. Click a heading and you jump to that section of the article. Want to read more about Africa? Click See Also and you can jump instantly to any of these related topics. Speaking of jumps, let's go back to the Africa article. See how some of the words are colored and underlined? That means they're hot. With a quick click, you can jump to another topic. How to get back? Just click Go Back on the main button bar. In the article frame, you'll also find the Copy and Print buttons. These are handy when you want to quote or paraphrase information you find in Encarta. Now let's move from the article frame to the gallery frame. This is where you'll find pictures and charts and maps. Sounds too. And sometimes even animations. You can just click your way through the gallery items for that topic. Notice that the article's keeping up with us. Just like the text, many gallery items can be zoomed, copied, and printed for your own use. Okay, on to the main button bar. It's where you'll find some of Encarta's coolest features. Like the Atlas, where you'll find maps and information from all over the world. To get around the globe, you click the arrows to rotate it. Then just click any spot for a closer look. All the place names are hot. Let's click Nigeria to find out more about it. Hear how the name's pronounced. Nigeria. Or go to a gallery of sights and sounds to get a sense of what it's like there. From the atlas, you can even jump to a topic on that particular place. It's that fast and that easy. Back on the main button bar, right next to the atlas, you'll also find Encarta's timeline. You can travel through time by dragging the scroll bar at the bottom. Here we're in the time of the Old Kingdom in Egypt. Everything on the timeline is hot. Click an event icon to read about important people and events, and special customs too. If you click an arrow, you get an article on that period in history, kind of like a little time capsule. Want to learn more? Choose an encyclopedia topic and jump to it. When you get a chance, check out the other features on the main button bar. You'll find a pair of browse buttons for flipping through topics in alphabetic order. And there's a gallery button to check out pictures, sounds, and animations. The find button is a great way to locate information in the encyclopedia. Or use contents to go right to a topic you know you want to explore. Click menu and there's even more. You can create a note or bookmark, use the dictionary, or even play Encarta's Mind Maze game. If you have questions, click Help! There's a whole set of help topics, plus more help demos. Go ahead, try it out yourself. Start by looking up something, anything you're interested in. Or as a kickstart, follow along with the scenarios in the books on your mark or to the finish line. To get going, just close this window and continue to explore Encarta.